doing? Pretty good, how are you? Pretty good, pretty good. I'm Brad Waite. How you doing, Donna Zaski? Nice to meet you, Donis. Uh, how was that weather on the way in, huh? Oh, this is actually, uh, it's getting pretty bad. Actually. Yeah, I saw that on the Doppler, it was getting pretty rough out there. Is it snowing quite a bit now? Yeah, the snow's piling up a little bit. Saw an accident, you know, but uh, made it here safe. It's a good deal. We're looking forward to hearing from you. Uh, first off, uh, this interview is going to take about five to seven minutes. Uh, I'm going to ask you some questions, just get to know you a little better, and then we'll get to the questions on why you should be in our organization. Okay, so let's get started. Uh, tell me a little about, bit about yourself, Adonis. Um, uh, growing, I grew up in uh, the inner city parts of uh, Memphis, Tennessee, and uh, and and over time, I've come across some troubled individuals, and uh, I started playing baseball actually to uh, to help myself, you know, stay out of trouble and things yeah, like that. Sports are good for young children. Yeah, and uh, started with the RBI organization, which all which is also run through y'all. And uh, with great work, work ethic, I bettered myself and received a scholarship to play baseball at Oklahoma City University. Uh, graduated with a bachelor's in business management. That's great. On uh, June 6, 2014, I was drafted in the 20th round by the Boston Red Sox. Awesome. Unfortunately, things didn't go as planned, but it also gave me an opportunity to learn more and uh, pass that knowledge down to others. Yeah, getting your getting your diploma is always a good thing, but that is awesome to get drafted by a professional baseball club. Okay, uh, do you have any prior experiment or experience with the game of baseball? Uh, yes, I've played baseball since I was seven years old. It has taught me many different life lessons. It has made me into a better person overall. Um, like I said earlier, I've come across you know a lot of different people. You know, troubled individuals, baseball players, and coaches. With this, I've learned to deal with different personalities, and uh, this I feel this would help me greatly while working here, simply because I'll get the chance to meet different types of people, and Absolutely. being able to handle the different personalities will lead to satisfaction from both parties. Good, good. Uh, I see you have a competitive nature. Obviously, uh, how might this help you better our youth and mentor them? Uh, I, I feel that this would benefit our youth tremendously. And uh, I love for competition it drives me to do my best and I work my competition. My experience alone speaks for itself. Um, I, will, I will be able to provide a wide variety of physical and most importantly mental skills. And this will better the kids on and off the field and in an instance that there'll be less trouble at home and at school. Sure, that does make sense. Absolutely. Okay. Um, why should we hire you versus our other qualified applicants? Uh, I deserve this position because I am well qualified. I'm competitive, dedicated, motivated, and I will and I work well with others. That's good. That's good traits to have. Uh, you know, this alone, it puts me ahead of the curve. You know, my, my motto is, you know, I like to show up early and leave late. With this being said, you know, getting to work early is something I strive myself on. And, you know, I base, you know, I base myself on that. And with leaving work late, it's basically saying, you know, whatever, whatever needs to be done that day that didn't, you know, didn't get done, you know, I like to, I like to get on the goals finished. That's good, because, you know, here we're, we're also a team, so, you know, we, we have a overall goal that we're trying to strive for, mm -hmm. so that's good, that's good. Um, tell me something about yourself you could change or fix. Um, I would say patience, simply because I tend to get very impatient, and when, when, I, I, when people aren't as hardworking as I am, Mm -hmm. You know, this, it kind of, you know, it kind of brings it out of me. But I've realized over time and with growth and age, um, I've realized that some people aren't as passionate and as driven as I am. Okay, good. Good. Okay. I think that's about all I have for you. Uh, do you have any questions for me? Uh, yes. Um, 
how often will I get to work with troubled and unprivileged youth? Um, you know, that's a that's a good question about how much. That's not really something I can answer right now, but uh, we do have summer camps and clinics that aim to help troubled and underprivileged children uh, at our facilities and stadium, and it's all in downtown Houston, so that's about it. All right.